Or it's just gonna keep going. Fuck it. Okay, cool. We got time. Do we? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's 2.30. Okay. So, happy Monday. Happy Monday. (laughs) I know. I like your last one better. Uh, Really? Uh, Yeah, I can tell you a little more daring than this one. But you're really not good enough for that yet. It's oh my god, flat. fuck you, bitch. Like your that dick. may be true, whiskey but dick. I just wanted to try something different. You're a whiskey dick. I'm still figuring this all out. I mean, I always like poems that I'm trying too hard. I hate when people try to sound fancy or add more meaning to it by using annoying and complicated language. Just make it simple, cute, and to the point. You always head over heels with all this cryptic nonsense, but I see right through that BS. Ha! Oh my god. Man, you really look so hard for all these deep meanings. It's just an excuse to have no meaning at all. I guess that's one way to look at it. Well, everyone has their own opinion. But my opinion is the best opinion. I'm sure you feel that Jesus out already. Jesus Christ, bitch. Uh... Anyway, here's my poem. Maybe you'll learn something. Amy likes spiders. You know Where's what I heard back? about Amy? Amy likes spiders. People Icky, Rick, shut the fuck up. I'm trying to read. Amy likes spiders. Icky, wriggly, hairy, ugly spiders. That's why I'm not friends with her. Amy has a cute singing voice. I heard her singing my favorite love song. Every time she sang the chorus, my heart would pound to the rhythm of the words. But she likes spiders. That's why I'm not friends with her. One time I hurt my leg really bad. Amy helped me up and took me to the nurse. I tried not to let her touch me. She likes spiders, so her hands are probably gross. That's why I'm not friends with her. Amy has a lot of friends. I always see her talking to people. She probably talks about spiders. What if her friends start to like spiders too? That's why I'm not friends with her. It doesn't matter if she has other hobbies. It doesn't matter if she keeps it private. It doesn't matter if it hurts anyone. It's gross. She's gross. The world is better off without spider lovers. Spider lovers. And I'm going to tell everyone. Not bad, right? It's quite a bit longer than yesterday's. Yesterday's was way too short. I was just warming up. I hope you didn't think it was the best I could do. No, no, of course not. Anyway, the message is pretty straightforward in this poem. <laughs> I don't have to explain it! Okay, you, you may be topping out a little bit too much every time. <laughs> a little bit. Sometimes you can explain complicated issues with much simpler analogies. And it helps people realize how stupid they're being! Uh, hello? Oh. Connection lost. <laughs> Connected. There we go. <laughs> I don't really agree that the subject of this poem is an ignorant jerk. Do, do you know people like that? Of course! It's about how everyone thinks me. It doesn't matter, it can be about anything. I wrote it to be easy to relate to. I even have some kind of weird hobby or guilty pleasure. Something that you're afraid people find out and make fun of you and think less of you. But that just makes people stupid. Who cares if someone likes as long as they're not hurting anyone? It makes them happy. I think people really need to learn to respect others for liking weird things. That's funny. Yuri wrote about something similar today. Did you say Yuri? Yeah. She said her poem was about an unusual hobby of hers. It didn't re- I didn't really get it, but she said something similar to you. That people shouldn't make each other feel insecure about those things. Really? Well, I mean, Yuri's pretty weird, so I wouldn't doubt that she has some weird hobbies. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Uh, it's not like I would judge her or anything. Natsuki has trouble finding words. Yes. Try not to be so meaner. She feels insecure about her weird behaviors and stuff. I mean, I just hate people who make me feel insecure. You made me feel insecure yesterday. But the way you put it, it sounds like she learned her lesson. Uh, uh, Yeah, I would say so. Even if her writing style is really different, I'm sure she'll appreciate the message in your poem. Boobs. (laughs) What? (laughs) It's what I do best, after all. Boobs. You do boobs best? I do like writing unless this is a good message to take away from it. I can feel emotions, it's important. But I want to make people think, not just feel, your dick inside me. Remember that? Jesus Christ. I'm gonna write a good one for tomorrow too, so look forward to it. Okay, everyone. We're all done meeting each poems, right? I have something extra Ooh. planned today, so if everyone could come sit at the front of the room. Is this about the festival? Well, sort of. Yeah, well, do we have to really have to do something for the festival? 
It's not like we can put together anything good in just a few days. We'll just end up embarrassing ourselves instead of getting any new members. That's a concern of mine as well. I don't really do well with last minute preparations. Don't worry so much. We're gonna keep it simple, okay? We won't need much more than a few decorations. Sayori has been working on posters Ooh. and I've designed some pamphlets we can give out during the events. Okay, that's great, no. But then Dick tell us what we're actually going to be doing for the event. Ah, I'm sorry. I thought you heard about it already. We're going to be performing. Performing? Oh, uh, Monica. Yeah, we're going to have a poetry performance. Each of us are going to choose a poem to recite during the event. But the cool part is, we're also going to let anyone else come up with and recite poems too. Sayori's Jeez, putting it all on nice. the poster in case anyone wants to prepare ahead of time. Yeah. Sayori, who's been coloring a poster, holds it up for us to see. Are you kidding me, Monica? You didn't start putting those posters up, did you? Eh, uh, well, I did. Do you really think it's that bad of an idea? Well, no. Not bad idea. I didn't sign up for this, you know? There's no way I'm going to be performing Jesus in front of a Christ. group of people like that. I, I agree with Natsuki. I could never in my life do something like that. Imagining it, Yuri shakes her head in fear. Guys! No, Sayori. I understand where they're coming from. Remember that Nasuki and Yuri have never shared their poems That's with true. anyone until just a couple days ago. It's a lot to ask of them to recite their poems out loud for yeah, a whole room yeah, of people. Yeah. And it's a lot to ask of you to wait until next time. Bye-bye. 